Vaping has really emerged as an epidemic amongst our youth. Maybe you've seen it and maybe you've smelt it. The Food and Drug Administration says vaping and e-cigarettes continue to grow in popularity, especially with teens. More than one in four teens in the U.S. use vapes daily. And in Texas, 19 percent of high school students vape. Vaping is a huge concern for us. To resolve the teen vaping epidemic, state lawmakers passed Texas House Bill 114 last year. It bans e-cigarettes from schools and requires students in violation to be placed into a District Alternative Learning Education Program, or DAEP. In Round Rock ISD, students caught with vapes face up to 15 days of DAEP. Over in Lake Travis ISD, it's up to 45 days for repeat offenders. But Austin ISD is trying a new way to get students to quit. We want to be even uh, more proactive with you know, educating students on the front end about the harmful effects of vaping. AISD's Board of Trustees have allowed an exemption for the district to rework their vaping policy. Instead of immediate disciplinary actions, students will go through educational training on the dangers of nicotine and peer pressure. This allows us to be able to address it with education prior to um, using punitive consequences. Ty Shepis, a professor at Texas State University, says AISD's educational approach could have a better chance at getting teens to quit vaping than typical disciplinary action. You're really typically not going to see much success from a very punitive approach that just punishes the use. If anything, adolescents will just get smarter about hiding it, which for their long-term health, we would much rather they change that behavior. So far, AISD says they're ahead of the curve with getting teens to quit, and with their educational approach, they hope students continue to see through the smoke. With our proactive measures, we've actually seen a, um, a reduction in number of vaping incidents from last school year. Uh, we want them to be in the right state of mind, the right uh, frame, and just making sure that they're taking care of their bodies. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.